Ugh, sounds like someone's at the door again. All I want to do is watch ice road truckers in peace. Is that too much to ask? Oh, hey Fred. Oh my god, who the heck are you and how the frick do you know my name? Explain yourself right now or I'm calling the cops. Okay, okay, calm down. I'm Kendra, a friend of Daphne's. I was just stopping by to show her some new iPhones I got. Daphne, get over here right freaking now or I'll smash your phone. Someone's here to see you. Now I'm off to drink some beer. Huh, I wonder who it could be. Hi Daphne. Oh, hi Kendra. What's up? Okay, so you're never going to believe this, but I won the lottery yesterday and then bought both the iPhone 8 and the iPhone 10. Want to see them? Oh my god. That is totes awesome. Of course I do. Come on inside and show them to me. Okay. So here's the iPhone 8. It's totally way better than the 7 because it's newer, and even better is the iPhone 10. I took a picture of it with the iPhone 8 and posted it on Instagram. Everyone was so jealous. I am too. You are so lucky to have won the lottery and been able to buy those amazing phones. I actually had an iPhone 10 briefly on Christmas Eve night, but it was confiscated by the police within a few hours. Wait, what? How come the police confiscated it? Um, well, I just might have stolen it from like a Christmas party or something. It's really not important. Uh, okay then. Anyway, I should probably get going now. I'm on my way to go grocery shopping. And you bet I'll take some totes awesome selfies while I'm at the supermarket. It was nice talking to you, and I'm glad I got to stop by. See ya. You too. Bye. Man, I sure wish I was a millionaire and could buy expensive things like that whenever I wanted. At the very least, I just want those two phones. Well, I suppose I could ask Fred to buy them for me, but I'd be living in another dimension if he said yes. Oh well. It can't hurt to try I guess. Man, this is some good beer. Hey Fred. Holy Jesus Daphne, you scared the living daylights out of me. What on this great big mother earth do you want? Okay, sorry for scaring you, but Kendra just showed me some new iPhones that she got, and I was wondering if you'd be willing to buy the same phones for me. They are the iPhone 8 and the iPhone 10. Not funny. Now get out of my face. Oh, come on, Fred. This isn't a joke. I know you have a lot of money. You're just too cheap to spend it on anything. Can't you just be generous for once and buy me something I want? No. Those phones are what? A thousand dollars each? There is no way that I'm spending that much money on you, and that's final. If you don't buy me the phones now, then I'll go outside and screw up your van. Oh, yeah? What are you going to do to it? I'm going to bust out all of the windows and slash the tires. Okay, do it. I'll just make you pay for new windows and new tires. Come on, do it right now. Well, since that didn't convince you, let's try this. If you buy me the phones now, I will pay you back later. Oh, really? Just where the frick are you going to get the money? Here's an idea. How about you get a job at McDonald's or some... Watch your profanity. Earn money and buy the phones yourself. Oh my god. I'm way too good for McDonald's and I'm offended by that statement. Now you should definitely buy me the phones to make up for offending me. Listen, I am not freaking buying you those iPhones. Why can't you get that through your head? Now go away before I get my chainsaw and cut up your room to smithereens. Okay, fine. Well that clearly didn't work. There's got to be another way to get those phones. I might as well Google how to become a millionaire. If I have that much money, then I'll be able to buy the phones and so much more. Hey, what's this YouTube video? How to instantly live like a millionaire? That's just what I'm looking for. Hey y'all, my name is Dick Richardson, and today I'm gonna be showing you how you can instantly live like a millionaire. So what you gotta do is get this thing here called a credit card. 
when you have this, peoples will let you buy their stuff without actually paying for it. So, you can go out and buy all kinds of expensive crap that only millionaires can afford, such as a Rolls Royce, or those two iPhones that Daphne really wants right now. True, this method ain't gonna make you an actual millionaire, but it'll still get you all the expensive stuff you want, that is, until the bank comes and takes it away cause you don't got the actual money to pay off this thing he called debt. Anyway, I hope you peoples on the YouTubes find this info useful. This is Dick Richardson, signing off. Oh my god, that's totally genius. I will just steal Fred's credit card and buy the phones I want, and maybe some other expensive stuff while I'm at it. Let me search his room for the credit card. Huh, I don't see it. Oh, there it is. He's such an idiot for just leaving it on his desk like that. Time to go to the Apple store and buy those iPhones. I think I'll ask Fred if I can borrow his van so I don't have to walk all the way there. Hey Fred. Oh my freaking god. What on earth could you possibly want from me now, Daphne? Well, I am, um, uh, I'm going out with friends and the person who was, uh, supposed to pick us up. Well, um, their car broke down so I was wondering if I could borrow your van. Why am I getting the feeling that you and your dumb friends are going to end up either crashing it or breaking it in some other way? Um, I don't know, but I promise we'll be extra careful with it. Oh, and I also recently learned how to drive stick shift, so I won't end up destroying the clutch either. Okay, fine, I'll let you dummies borrow it if it makes you leave me alone. Also, I'm not buying the part about you knowing how to drive a manual car. I'm going to check with the auto parts store while you're gone to see if they have a spare clutch assembly on hand. Yay! Thanks so much Fred for letting me borrow it. LOL, Fred is totally clueless about what I'm about to do. This is hilariously awesome. Okay, let's start this thing up and get going. Man, the engine sure is making a funny sound. I guess I'll just keep trying to start it though. Holy mother of God Daphne, what the heck are you trying to achieve by leaning on the horn? I was trying to watch TV and couldn't hear anything. If this is a prank, it's not funny. Wait, I was leaning on the horn? I thought that button was to start the engine. Well gang, I think we've got another mystery on our hands, why Daphne thinks the button for the horn starts the engine. Hey, stop making fun of me and just tell me what to do. Okay. So on old 60s vans like the Mystery Machine, you have to pull something called a choke before turning the key or else it won't start. What's a choke and what's a key? You know what, that's it. Get out of the van and let me start it for you. Now drive away and get out of my life. Okay, fine. You don't have to be so mean about it. Alright. Time to put on my music. Since today is Friday, I know the perfect song to listen to. But first, I need to pair my phone with the van's Bluetooth system. OMG, this van doesn't even have Bluetooth? What a piece of crap. I am so buying an expensive Rolls Royce after I buy the phones at the Apple store so I don't have to deal with Fred's freaking Stone Age fan anymore. OMG 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 These are the two phones I want I totes need to buy Hey PC guy How dare you enter an Apple store This store is for Apple lovers only And your name clearly says that you prefer PCs Oh no Please don't beat me with that Okay, I'm not really sure what that was all about, but anyway, it's time to buy these phones. Hello and welcome to the Apple Store. 
How may I help you? I would like to buy both the iPhone 8 and the iPhone 10. Okay. Will you be paying in cash or credit? Credit. All right. Just swipe your credit card in the machine and you'll be good to go. Thank you for your purchase and have a nice day. Thank you. You too. OMGA. This is totes awesome. Hashtag just got two new iPhones. Now it's time to go buy a new Rolls Royce and say goodbye to Fred's crappy mystery machine. Hello, and welcome to Rolls Royce Motor Cars of Go City. What can I do for you today? Well, I was hoping to buy a car from you guys. Alright, which model do you think you may be interested in? Well, to be honest, I haven't researched a whole lot. Okay, I haven't researched at all. I just want the fanciest and most expensive one that you have. Right this way. I know just the car for you. Alright, let's see it. Okay, so this is the top of the line 2019 Rolls Royce Phantom. Let me tell you a little bit about it, starting with the interior and its features. So the last thing I want to talk about is the price. This car would normally be worth around $500,000, but because of all the custom performance upgrades that have been added to it, we are now selling it for $1 million. That sounds good to me. I have my credit card and I am ready to purchase the car today. Wait a minute, how are you able to purchase a $1 million car with a credit card? Because this is the Go Animate universe, where real life logic doesn't apply. Oh that's right. Anyways, we will quickly clean out the car and then it's all yours to drive home in. We can have an employee drive your other vehicle to your house if that works. That sounds great. Thank you so much. OMG 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 OMFG I can't believe I now own a Rolls Royce and two of the latest iPhones. I feel like a freaking millionaire now. I have to go tell the rest of the gang about this. Oh, look who it is. I was hoping you'd get into a traffic jam or something so I could have more Daphne free time. Shut up friend. I don't feel like dealing with your negativity right now. Hey guys. Oh, there you are Daphne. Where have you been? Okay, so I don't know if you're going to believe me when I say this, but earlier today, I stole Fred's credit card and made up some fake excuse to borrow his van. I then went out and bought an iPhone 8, an iPhone 10, and a brand new Rolls Royce. Wow Daphne, like that's amazing. I had no idea you were that savage. I agree, that sounds so epic. Well, I disagree. Fred is going to give you a major concussion time for this one. You know what Vilma, you're probably right, but it's still worth it because I now own some super fancy stuff that only millionaires are able to afford. You're right when you say only millionaires are able to afford things like that. When Fred isn't able to pay the debt off of his credit card, the bank will repossess everything. Oh crap, I never thought about that. All gang members, report to the front yard immediately and get in the van. We're going grocery shopping because I'm all out of beer and steak. Okay, so here's the deal. I'm going to let each of you buy your own food, but don't let the total cost get into the triple digits. Oh, and don't do anything stupid that'll get us kicked out. Now let's go and get this stupid grocery shopping over with. Okay, Fred, like I got it. Hey, where are all you idiots going? Get in the van right now or it's concussion time. Like no man, I think we'd all rather take Daphne's new Rolls Royce to the grocery store. We'll like find you in the parking lot when we get there and meet up with you. WHAT THE f That Rolls Royce is Daphne's? I thought some rich douchebag parked it in front of my house to taunt me. How in tarnation did Daphne even get a car, let alone an expensive one? Like she stole your credit card and bought it for a million dollars, along with two iPhones. That's it. I am so done with you. It's all tremendous concussion time.